Hey everybody, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's your girl Gab, and I'm back with another video. Before we get into it, make sure you like, subscribe, and click that bell so you don't miss any videos from me in the future. Now let's get into it. If you be my rider, then I'll be your lover, be your provider. I know I'm a liar, but never in Okay, first things first. Let's get into the edges. Ooh! Ooh! It's swoodle, squee boop. Can, like, let's talk about it real quick, my girls, okay? I don't know about y'all, because I y'all be slaying y'all edges every time. Usually, I don't do my edges unless, um, it depends on what hairstyle I'm doing. Sometimes I just let my edges do what they want to do. Because, honestly, my hair, like, my hair is kind of wavy. So, when I try to do my edges, it don't last that long. Um, like, they just, they curl up at the ends always. And then if I sweat a little bit, it's up with. Um, if I just breathe too hard, it's up with. Like, I mean, they, they'll still, from a distance, look how, you know what I'm saying, they looked at the, in the morning. But it don't last all day. It's giving my hair is fragile. Oh, first off, it's not fragile. But my edges don't know how to hold it. Like, come on now. But it looks good right now. So, you know, I got my little neon orange scrunchie in. I got my little dark orange lippy on. We got the orange top going. I mean, it's, you know? So today's video, we're gonna be talking about what's on my phone, okay? I don't really have, you know what I'm saying, a lot of craziness on my phone. Uh, I like to keep it, you know, just normal. I haven't really gotten into the whole aesthetic thing of, um, you know, having everything set up crazy uh, to have aesthetically pleasing and all that. I'm just not into all that yet. I think I used to do that back when I was in high school a lot, when I used to jailbreak my phones and all that, but then I just uh, got out of that. So, you know, it is what it is. So we're gonna go ahead and get into what's on my phone. I'm gonna be talking about some of the apps that I have. We might see some, um, I don't know what we're gonna see. Honestly. So first things first, let's start off with what I have as the lock screen, you know, the blonded. Um, I love Frank Ocean, so had to. Um, look at my cute case, y'all. So cute. Anyways, so I keep my home screen kind of, home screen. I keep my home screen kind of the same as it comes when you get the phone. I don't like to change that too much. Uh, maybe just, I don't, not sure why. But um, I have a few screens of apps because I usually used to have them all like categorized like I do here at the top. But um, it's just that I started adding other apps and I just haven't gotten around to, um, you know, organizing them. But we can get into a little bit. So, I have everything categorized by like what it is. So, I have all my social um, apps here, anything from Twitter to WhatsApp, you know, things like that sort. Um, we have all my food apps, places that I like to order from, except for Burger King. I don't know why I have Burger King on there. I don't remember why I had Burger King on there. I don't even like Burger King. Oh, I think it was like a T-Mobile Tuesday thing. Um, so then we have my shopping apps. These are the most places who like to take my money. They like to rob me. I don't know why the stock X, X is like that, why the app looks like it's sideways. Um, we have my entertainment for when I'm at work or somewhere getting my hair done or something and I just wanna watch some TV or some shows or stuff on the go. Um, also, I don't know if y'all have the Peacock app, but if you're an Office fan like I am, you probably do. And um, it's kinda, like I like it on the phone, but it's not that great on the PlayStation, if you have a PlayStation. I don't know why y'all need to know that, but I just told y'all anyway. So, these are my music apps. Um, Pandora I usually only use for work. 
uh, if I just want a certain kind of music going on, because you know we have patience, it has to be kind of just PG music, no explicit anything. Um, SoundCloud, you know, uh, mixtape music, you know, just underground people. And Alexa, because she, um, yeah. Because you can play music from her, that's what I was trying to say. And we got our finance. Uh, you know, I bank with Navy Fed. Uh, cash app, you know, other bills I pay. My phone. Robin Hood, you know, if you're in the stocks. Acorns, if y'all don't know about that, y'all need to get into that. It basically is kind of gets you into investing, but it's like you don't have to do all the figuring out where to put your money at. So basically, say you bought something, it was $2.50, okay? It'll take that 50 cents, like it'll round it up to a dollar, take that 50 cents and then invest it. it it'll, they'll invest it for you. And then, um, and then, and that's it, that's, that's it. So it's almost like a savings type of account. Um, and you can also, um, you can also deposit money into their weekly or monthly or however often you want to in addition to it rounding up your change and investing it so it works as like a good little savings account you know what else we got on here we got my games okay sometimes i don't really play these a lot but i play them sporadically so basically i'll it'll be a chapter in my life where i will play a lot of like all my mobile games and then i'll get tired of them and then i won't play them for months and then I'll be like, oh, I forgot I had this game on here still. And then I'll pick it back up. Like right now I'm playing Homescapes. The, let me tell you about Homescapes and games like Homescapes. Those games are the ones that have those crazy ads that are like, oh, um, help him get unstuck from the well or whatever. And it's just another Candy Crush lookalike. However, I do love Homescapes because basically you are doing these puzzles to renovate this mansion and it's kind of nice and that game they've actually incorporated those um misleading mini game ads that they have they've actually incorporated those into the game now too so you do get to play a couple of those games so it's cool um so yeah that's what we got there we got my health apps you know Nike Training Club, Nike Run Club, y'all gotta have those. Those are the staples. Those are the staples. Um, you know, my Apple Watch Fitness app, uh, got some yoga apps on there. Um, that Mind Body app, I actually need to delete that. That's when I was um, with a personal trainer and I was paying way too much a month for them. And that's where I would schedule my classes, like my training, train, my, yeah, classes with my trainer. Um, the Strong app, if you're into, you know what I'm saying, lifting or whatever, and you want to um, track your workouts and stuff, and build your routine and have it where like you have set days where you do certain stuff and it keeps track and it tells your personal records and all that, the Strong app is great for that. And then I have my Navy PRT app because um, your girl gotta make sure ahead of time what numbers I need to get so I don't do too much you know what I'm saying so yeah and I got my photo editing apps and anything I have to do with my camera and anything like that other apps you know I got my traveling apps Expedia Airbnb um, I used to be an uber driver and I never been an uber driver um, I, I used to do uber in Chicago a little bit um, T-Mobile Tuesdays. If you got T-Mobile, you don't have T-Mobile Tuesday app. Even Sprint customers as well. Y'all need to get that. It's free stuff every Tuesday, and they have certain stuff that'll be like ongoing all the time. Tap in. Um, you know your Yelp, your Ticketmaster, Afterpay. I just got on Afterpay. Um, and I like it. I like it a lot. I love that it doesn't run, like run your credit because gotta keep credit good you know what I'm saying so I don't need her run every two seconds but um I like doing that because especially when I do like my clothing hauls and I buy um clothes obviously clothing haul if I had to return something I don't like having to wait for my refund so if I you know 
every two weeks having something taken out. It's just better, I don't know. At the top here is my widget for my do app that y'all see on the last uh, the last app on the third row. And that's where like I can keep all of my things I have to do, you know, my to-do list. And um, I love it because you can visibly see, you know what I'm saying, what you have, you know, you just double tap and everything, it just scratches out or you can double tap and it'll un, un whatever, what's it, unline it out. Um, and it's just a good way for me to keep up with my things. Uh, and I like that it's just nice. You can have a bigger widget, I just don't. I haven't figured out how I want my screens to look yet now, so. The Way app, let me tell y'all about this Way app, okay? This app is good for if you travel a lot um, via plane and you usually take yourself to the airport and you know airport usually be charging a lot for parking every day. This app will find where, um, Okay, I can't show y'all. But this app will show y'all uh, hotels and stuff that are nearby that have 24 seven surveillance for your car while you're gone. You can park your car there for way cheap. I, when I went to, I went to Vegas and Cali last year. I was gone for 14 days, two weeks. I would have been paying $140 had I parked at Charlotte's airport, but I parked at whatever hotel it was and I only spent 40 bucks. Get into it, tap into that. Save your coins, okay? Um, What else we got? My countdown, you know, 79 days ago from out of here. Out of here! The Navy won't ever see me again for a little bit, you know? I love this app. Um, what else, what else, what else we got? I See, I gotta put my Zaxby's in my food, my food category. Um, so, so, and Uber Eats, I don't even use Uber Eats. Um, Turo is also another good app. If you're under the age of 25 and you're trying to rent a car somewhere, this is like the Airbnb for cars and you don't gotta pay no crazy fee because you're underage to rent a car. Love it. Um, BitLife. In and out of this this game app, it's like a simulation app. It's really stupid, but it's super fun and it's a good time passer. So if you if you don't have it, get it. Um, this full code, I'm about to delete it. I thought it was more like a game, and it's more so if you actually do work in like serious healthcare, like take care of patients, and it like it's good practice for like making sure you know how to basically treat your patients. So it's a really good app if you really want to get into healthcare, making sure, you know, studying your medical school or something like that. Zillow, you know, looking at $3 million homes that I can't afford and being mad when it's taken out the market. Uh, Duolingo, 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 I just got back into that. I'm trying to get back into being fluent in Spanish because I really was like that. I really was speaking Spanish like that. And um, I just stopped doing it, so. Uh, I'm trying to get back into it. But uh, yeah, that's really all I got on this phone without getting too into it. Uh, of course, you know, we got Rihanna in the back taking out the trash. Some of y'all need to be hopping in them bags that she's taking out. But that's on my phone. So y'all didn't ask, but I gave it to y'all anyway. Be going. But yeah, let's get back into this case, okay? This case is so cute. Can we, there we go. Give it up for the case. I love these like boxy, um, the square like type cases, you know? I don't know why I love those so much. This is, this is an iPhone XS Max. I have had this for, I think over two years, which is the longest I have ever had a phone because I'm usually always upgrading, upgrading, upgrading. As soon as a new one come out, I'm upgrading. But honestly, I just haven't seen the reason to upgrade because I mean, the cameras are great and I love that. However, it's just, I don't want my phone to go up. Let's be real. 
when you get older and you start really adulting, you really get into the bill stage of adulting, you realize like, hey, that phone bill can stay right where it is because babe, I don't, mm-mm, mm-mm, mm-mm. It's not giving what it's supposed to give. Adulting is not giving what it's supposed to give, okay? This is a scam. Anyways, so, anyways, Anyway, so that is the end of this video. Thank you for, you know what I'm saying, hanging with me while we went through my phone, see what apps I have. Hope y'all found some apps that y'all want to put on your phones. Um, other than that, that's all I have for you all. Thank you for watching. Please make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Share with your friends. You know, let's get, let's get up to 500. That's the next milestone, 500. We're gonna do another giveaway at 500. Um, our last giveaway was at 400. We did a $25 Amazon card. They're just gonna get even better. So let's let's get these let's get these subs rolled in, okay? So I'll catch y'all my next video.